Since the 1930s, scientists have known that the sun and other stars generate their energy by nuclear fusion. It could provide a safe and clean source of energy. Extensive research in the 1950s saw the beginning of a worldwide effort to develop a fusion reactor. Recently, a British-based company has created a mini-fusion reactor, which they claim is capable of producing temperatures comparable to that of our sun. They hope that this breakthrough is the first step to putting fusion-produced energy on the commercial market by 2030. Tokamak Energy has had a breakthrough of their miniature nuclear fusion reactor known as the ST40. In a press release, the company announced their researchers managed to achieve plasma temperature of approximately 50 million degrees Celsius inside the machine. The CEO of the company, Jonathan Carling, said the following, We are taking significant steps towards achieving fusion energy, doing so with the agility of a private venture, driven by the goal of achieving something that will have huge benefits worldwide. We hope that when they will be able to refine the technology enough to begin marketing it as a viable source of energy on the commercial market by 2030. To create these extremely high temperatures, the fusion reactor utilizes a process known as merging compression. This happens when energy is released in the form of rings of plasma, which collide with each other within the reactor, and then produce magnetic fields which snap together in a process known as magnetic reconnection. The company have said the compact design of the reactor makes this process more comfortable, but they hope to design an industrial scale energy device. The coming years are crucially important to putting the world on a path of reduced greenhouse gas emissions. By the end of the century, demand for energy will have tripled. Under the combined pressure of population growth, increased urbanization, and expanding access to electricity in developing countries, fusion doesn't emit harmful toxins like carbon dioxide or other greenhouse gases into the atmosphere. Nuclear fusion reactors produce no high-activity, long-lived nuclear waste. The activation of components in a fusion reactor is low enough for the materials to be recycled, or reused within a hundred years. Nuclear fusion is considered to be one of the most critical fields in energy production today, as the world moves into a new era of clean methods of generating power. While the process is still not wholly efficient, Breakthroughs such as this demonstrate that nuclear fusion could be on the market very soon. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.